you know, we still need to get some of the younger guys um, in the right spots. But um, aside from that, pace looks pretty good, and um, you know, we're getting in better shape each and every day, and um, just waiting for the first game. Does it make a big difference now that you know Barris is the starter and you're repping him a lot? Um, in a way, yes, it does. But um, in Mount Zion, it's such you know repetition and things are held to a higher level to Mount Zion anyways that um, it doesn't make too much of a difference, you know, because we're we're always going to practice equally as hard and and the only thing that may be different is just the timing, you know. So, will there be a difference in this offense in terms of the the pace? I mean, with with Barrett being in the offense three mm -hmm. years. Do you think this offense is going to be faster than the previous season? Um, I think there's more of, more of a – I think Pace is going to be more of an element that we use more this year than we did last year, you could say. And it's going to be more of a weapon that we use more often than uh, we, we did last year. And um, in order to do that, we just got to keep working at it every day. I've asked you this before. I mean, Cam was a tank, mm -hmm. and Barrett's not so much. It's got to have some changes on this offense. Is it yeah, I'm, differently? I mean, no. I mean, like, like I told you before. I mean, Mazel's offense is not going to change for anybody. I mean, personnel is going to change, but the the offense in general is not going to change. You know, he's gonna he's gonna you know call plays to different guys' strengths, and but that's what Mazel's always done. I mean. Um, yeah, Barrett's probably not going to run the ball on fourth and one like Cam did, and everyone knows that just because of the two different sizes, two different type of guys. So, um, I mean, with that being said, in a way, but not really. Did you see much of this offense when Cristal was playing and stuff? Uh, yeah, I mean, the same thing. Like I said, nothing, nothing's really changed. What about uh, CJ? He showing what's good about him. You know, CJ's a big body, you know, and he's he's really picked up the offense well, and um, you know, and hasn't been afraid. You know, really stepped up and been physical in all the blocking drills, and has caught the ball well. And um, you know, he's going to help us a lot this year. And um, just you know, having that big body out there, you know, um, just help blocking on the perimeter and and you know, making those tough catches inside is uh, something that we need, and he brings that to the table. One of the big things last year with, with Cody and, and T-Zach and yourself was, was blocking on the perimeter. Troop parked mm -hmm. on that a lot last year. Do you see that carried over to the group this year? I mean, do you see some physicalness out there from those guys? Definitely, because in, in Coach Troop always says, in order for our offense to be successful, we, we have to be able to block on the perimeter. And, um, you know, with just with the running backs that we have, you, you, there's no telling where they're going to bounce the ball to. And, you know, as a wide receiver, you got to be ready. And uh, you got to stay square on that <laughs> defensive person and uh, make the block.